fun. Alright, let's start, kids. Are you ready? But before we do, who is ready to take a look to see what's inside our mystery box? Are you ready? Okay, on the count of three, say, take a look. Ready? One, two, three. Take a look. Great job, boys and girls. Let's see what's in our mystery box. Oh, we have. We have a plate. Oh, and we have an empty perfume bottle. Ooh. Let's go ahead, boys and girls, and open up our Bible story to the book of Mark. Today's story begins with a special dinner. This special dinner was for Jesus. As Jesus and the people ate and talked, a woman who was not invited walked in carrying a bottle of perfume. Now, this woman had made a lot of bad choices. So the people at the dinner didn't think they would see her there. Hmm, what do you think she did with the perfume? Do you think that she gave it the bottle to Jesus? Raise your hand if you do. Well, this woman sat down near Jesus' feet and she started to cry. The woman cried because Jesus had forgiven her for making bad choices. She knew Jesus still loved her no matter what. The woman was so thankful Jesus loved her that she wanted to do something special for him. So she washed his feet. That's right, Jesus' feet. She washed Jesus' feet with tears in her eyes and she dried them with her hair. Remember that perfume that she brought? She poured the perfume on Jesus' feet. The people at the party thought Jesus should stay away from this woman. You don't know what she's done, they'd say. Do you think Jesus agreed with them? No, of course he didn't. You're right. No way. Jesus just smiled. Let me see her smiles. Big, big, big smiles. Oh, those are great. He smiled. He smiled because he did know who this lady was. Jesus knew everything about this woman and everything that she had done. And he could see how sorry she was and how much she loved him. Jesus told her, woman, you are forgiven. Now go in peace. Friends, there is nothing, absolutely nothing you could ever do to make Jesus not love you. He loves you no matter what. He loves everybody. We need to remember who loves us. Who loves you? That's right, Jesus loves me. What about when you mess up? Who loves you? Jesus loves me. Turn to your neighbor and say, Jesus loves me. Boys and girls, go home and remind somebody that Jesus loves them and Jesus loves you. Let's go ahead and pray this morning, boys and girls. Father, we are so thankful for your forgiveness and your love. Lord, I pray that we can love like you. We thank you, Lord, for this story and how you sent your son to forgive this woman. 
Help us to be more like you, Jesus. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.